Hi, my dear friends, and uh, today I want to share with you um, the pens I, I'm using. I'm not very big or very professional or picky about pens, but I did found that when it is um, different pens gave you the different um, results when you write on the paper, the pen to the paper and pen you are using. So I want to just share with you the few what I definitely lo no, like the quality. And the good thing, all the pens I'm showing to you here, they're all um, not very expensive. They're very affordable price, but yet quality is very good. They probably, some of them are like, like maybe five, something, five, not more than ten dollars, between five to ten dollars. Um, depends. But they're all very nice a pencil i like that bag i actually pick up that bag how cute is that look at these kittens here i love it <laughs> so that is nice way when it stands right there when you can write um anyway um let me show you from the beginning first of all you probably know that brand sakura and it's very good brand it's very very affordable i would like to say it's almost cheap like probably maybe two dollars pen but they're very good and the particular colors what I like it is uh, if you will see online I know I buy that pens in Japan so it's big choices the classics or this is I think um, for me it's new I just discovered and it's called vintage style pens and it's very nice color here it's not like when you write it, it's not gray and not blue. It's very nice color, particularly that color I like, and that also they call it vintage. So they have five, dif four or five different colors, and again, it's Sakura vintage, uh, vintage line. So I will recommend you definitely that pens. Then um, that is uh, just like a design and. Um, and I like how it looks. It's kind of like more shabby, but it, it's it's basic pen, you know. Um, it writes nicely, but it's regular gel pen. But I like then it's uh, all that dingle in here. So that is the reason why. So that is more toy <laughs> purpose. Um, also, this is um, what is this brand? Um, uh, blah 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 blah. I think it's this is brand. Um, friction ball pen and oh, that is the brand I think this is the brand um, and it's uh, the good thing about uh, again it's very affordable pen um, I believe it's around in yens it's around for so it's around four something dollars will be if it's in dollar amount and it's gel pen you can write and then if you made the mistakes you can you can take this out even when it's gel pen so I really I like that pen they have many different colors so again very affordable and it's yet very very good pen so if you will look online that brand that you probably will like and especially if sometimes you make some mistakes um what else this is like uh, this is again um, uh, I pick up in Japan and it's um, it's like a kind of like basic pen but I like when it's heavy when you most of the cheapest pen if I if they less than ten dollars they kind of like very light but if somebody who likes heavy pen me personally uh, I like that and they go they uh, they can be the different like 0 0.3 0 0.4 0 0.5 um, I mean they can be the thickness of the uh, ball will be different. So this is again a uh, nice pen. So if it's, if you like heavy weight pen That I will recommend to you. Uh, of course, everybody knows that line um, It's Sakura again, right like that, but this is like uh, they call it um, I have only few colors, but it's very good um, is uh, how they call it, like milk, it's more like pastel colors and you can buy sets, five or six of them, or you can buy a single one. And uh, that is very pretty colors here. It's it's not uh, bright, uh, but yet it's like, they call. I think they call it milk, at least in, from Japanese they translate it as like milk, uh, milk 
colors there so that is good also many color few colors you can pick up same sakura brand i think this is the friction paper uh, friction uh pens not paper again uh they are same idea but it's more like highlight something and then you can you can um take it out same same idea like a pen but see same idea like pen so you can take this out so it's again it's same same like that pen but more highlighting if you want to make it a bigger a bigger um some bigger letters in your journals so that is good so the good and they like i said at least that pens i think the most expensive pen here is that i think it's or oh, in that this and that it's like around nine dollars or ten that is the fountain pen it's one of the not expensive uh but uh, there i like that particular because you can find fine or you know or like um and and see that smile i think that pen i don't know it's maybe for kids to lure i don't know but it's has very nice cute face right there so that is the fine um and fine this is the brand uh kakino pen um you can insert any any color inside only the top will be different when you will purchase them so this is i think you can also find online uh, they are very good uh, if you are just want to start from beginning these two pens i really like because again they're lean they are because they're longer than this pen uh, so they give more weight so this is why i really like that uh, pens um, they are again not really more like vintage style pens and um, again very fine so this is this was like 0 0.5 i think this is the 0 0.4 very fine very fine um writing this pen and uh just they have different tapping things so i put that that Alas Swarovski by myself because it's red ink there so that is a good pen same that uh, fountain pen like that but this is this is cheaper than that so I prefer probably go to spend uh, eight nine dollars instead to two or three dollars but again whatever you want guys it's your own choice or whatever you can afford so if you going to buy a very not expensive fountain pen that will be probably one but it's not my favorite um also the few the few pencils i want to tell you uh silver gold and white and i know so like people who likes to write a lot this is the questions for them and i found that uh very good again that is very common signium brand very common uh pens and uh, let me show you how they write silver and uh, silver and gold and it's okay see it's very shiny very shiny and the gold is and silver is same way and it's very rich it's very shiny i like that um if i will compare with all of so silver and gold probably I will recommend to go with Signia, uh, Signia ball pen, I like uh, Signia pens. Um, the another, it's also Signia, but they have more with. Um, uh, it's silver and gold, but it is more to, to how you call it, um, more more shine go there and it's more not so much shine cut it's like glitter like more like glitter going on there even when you write it the, the letters themselves you cannot see much more easy like that uh but on the lights they are shining much more if you will show them on the light they're shiny so this is what is uh that pens about um the white pen again signia i think it's very it's the, the most good pen on the white it's again signia and i uh, just will let you like, like show that on um let's see so 
see how right how how it writes very rich and nice and when it will dry of course it will stay there and uh, same signia but gold and silver it's also nice pen it's also writes very nicely here also my favorite uh, pen is that brand it's sakura again um, but it's not like this, uh, not, they are usually close cells in Japan next to each other, uh, but they are more in decorative side, like if you want to, uh, some like, uh, something to more in decorations side, and, uh, they, they can find them single colors, or you can find them on sets, they are very not... Uh, pricey but again they're very very good and I like that pen you can write on the paper like right here and I have uh, the greenish and the yellowish right now so let me write compare to you uh, so this is right on the paper and I just uh, mentioned in some of my video it writes very beautifully on any plastic um, glass or anything so I marked my glass bottles with that um, with that pen see again that is very nice so soon when it will dry you cannot you of course if you will take oil some oily you can take that uh, scripts out but in general it stays there so I actually mark on because my computer I need to have three languages in my computer buttons so I write uh, all letters in my computer with that pen and of course when you typed a lot you know it's still there so the that is very good um, they got they come in the black also so black is not I'm not it's not my favorite black it looks like more milky it's not very dense color uh, so but uh, because it's maybe because it's a little bit glitter there is supposed to be I don't know but I like more like light color so light colors is definitely go or go and look so if you will have chance to look online let's see you can search online that will be my recommendation for you to look for the pen if you are interested about it so thank you everyone for guys watching my video and um I always appreciate all your comments and I hope you all have a great, great day. Bye.